The Young and the Restless revealed that Nikki had to put in a very lot of effort to organize such a grand anniversary party. Even the special guest she invited to come here, how proud she was when she showed everything to Victor, as well as thanks to Tracy's help. Besides, this is also an opportunity to get the Newman family to get Tucker's company. But looking at everything right now, it's really chaotic. It was the Abbott family that ruined it. She wondered what they were up to at this point. Not just one, but many troubles kept happening, causing the celebration to be postponed. Nikki seems to want to explode. She hates them and believes that if they weren't there today, everything would be different. This sure is a memorable event for the people of Genoa. People get upset about what's going on, even taking turns leaving when they don't want to get in trouble. However, she would never have expected that everything would be led by a single Jeremy behind the scenes. Nikki did everything and prepared for the worst case scenario. However, this was beyond her imagination. Phyllis is comatose and hospitalized, which makes everyone feel anxious and insecure for her safety. Not long after that, the police also came to take statements and escorted Diana away to serve the investigation. What will happen in the near future? Does this make the relationship between the two already bad families even worse? The plot's becoming more dramatic than ever. Of course, Nikki will not leave everything to the Abbott family easily, and the leader will definitely be Jack and Diane. Not only did they ruin the important event everyone was expecting, but they also caused her a great loss. So they have to face a big compensation, but will Jack and Diane accept it or not? There's a chance they'll all put the blame on Phyllis and assume she's the one to start the conversation. However, Nikki doesn't have time to argue with them. Victor will also step in when someone hurts his wife about his plans. Nikki's going to the Abbott Mansion to discuss this, but will things be as simple as that? Please take the time to follow the latest developments surrounding the drama. As for the fans, what do you think is going on? What more troubles will Genoa City have to go through? How will Jack and Diane handle things? when all the criticism is directed at them. Will Phyllis be okay and soon be discharged from the hospital because perhaps the head injury is exactly dangerous? Will the relationship between Phyllis and her children improve through this? Leave your comments below to let us know.